So I was just chilling with an ice cold Dr. Pepper while playing some Black Ops 1. So, you know, I wasn't really doing much. I just tried to get my KD from a .01 to a .5. You know, nothing, nothing big. So after a few games, I joined a really interesting team deathmatch lobby. Everything was nice. Everything was all nice and quiet. But then um, I heard something. I was going for like a 720 insta swap on like Nuketown or something. And all I hear in the background is a subtle... Damn it. So I didn't think of it as much. I thought, oh, okay, it's just probably some kid kind of just getting a little bit mad. So I continued with the game, you know, try, still trying to get that 720 insta swap off a ladder or something like that. But after like 30 seconds of doing that, I hear it not really as like subtle as before, but you know, it's it was still pretty subtle. Fuck. Again, I thought, oh yeah, this this kid's just getting this kid's just getting a little bit mad. Again, I don't really think of it as much, so I, I didn't really care at the moment. I was just trying to get the trick shot. <laughs> then, after another 30 seconds, I, I see in the feed and I hear, Fucking damn it! <laughs> at this moment, I'm just like, dude, this kid's really getting butt hurt. <laughs> oh my god. No more than five seconds later, I hear, Fuck! The way I did it right there was like really, really like watered down. But the way they did it was that it was like really loud and they were like really squeaky when they did it. At this point, I'm just trying to hold back my laughter. I mean, I wasn't going to burst out laughing, but I mean, it was, I, was, I still thought it was pretty funny. <laughs> Next thing I hear is like some audible scream and then like three pounds on like a desk or something. Then them yelling, what mom? Keep in mind, this kid was like about 10 years old and was on like the verge of tears. So then I just start laughing. I mean, I'm just I'm just sitting there in the lobby just laughing. I mean, I couldn't even hold it back anymore. My ears are still ringing from what I heard that day. Do you think this is funny? Now grab that and get its squeakiness, times it by 1,063, and that's what it sounded like. I swear to God that he broke his mic. I mean, seriously, they, it was so loud. My ears might have been bleeding, but I just kept laughing because it was just too damn funny. I hear one more scream and then um, then the kid leaves the game. But that phrase, do you think this is funny, reminded me of a story back when I was like in fourth grade. So you guys know how in fourth grade you guys had like your games on the playground like tag or like hot lava monster or like hide and seek and stuff like that. My class had this really weird combination of hot lava monster and tag called like broster or something. I believe it was like from a family guy episode. That's how we named it, but I don't know if like the rules were from an episode or something like that. So one day we decided to play it, and I mean, it was recess time, we were at the playground, and I think I was it at the time. I, I, I might have not been, it was either my friend Cole or my friend Noel. I don't really know what sparked it, but like two of my friends just started like th throwing fake punches. Like you know how you make the noise with your mouth, like it goes like... Like, it sounds like you punched someone. They were just going off on each other. I mean, they weren't, like, hit, actually hitting each other. They were just, like, doing the fake noises and, like, but they were still doing the motion. Then being kids and whatnot, five seconds later, we all start doing it. Like, everyone in the playground are just, I mean, they're just joining in. I mean, they're just going off on each other, too. And what do you know? I join in, too. It's just a collage of... <laughs> then out of nowhere, we hear this really loud... Hey! I felt like I was the only one who turned around, and I saw a, um, I forgot if it was a man or a woman, but there was just someone standing there with their arms folded looking at us, and, I mean, a few of us stopped, and it's just like, alright guys, that's enough. But then the other half of us just kept going, I mean, it was like two seconds, and then the collage <laughs> continued. I, w I stopped, but then I turned around, and the person was gone. But then after a minute or so, we hear... All the boys to the principal's office. This is where we all stood frozen. Like, we, we looked at each other and we were just like, we're fucked. Like, there was no way we were going to get out of this. So all the boys, even the boys that weren't doing anything, even the boys that weren't even in the playground, they had to come too. So we all nervously walked into the principal's office. Half of us starting to cry because, like, most of us, we haven't been in the principal's office in our lives, and we thought this was like the biggest deal like ever. As soon as we walked in, we didn't see the principal, but there was this one lady there. I, we didn't know who she was. It turns out she was the vice principal, but 
we were just like confused at the moment literally like literally the first thing she says to us is are you guys proud of yourselves and we all just stood there i mean we didn't know what to say or do and after like 30 seconds of quiet she was just like i just got reports of a massive fight out on our playground a few of us tried to explain that we weren't really fighting but like she was just convinced that we were then of course, um, she went into this really, really long speech about like how we shouldn't be fighting and how we, one of us could have got hurt. I mean, we were all listening in on like the whole speech and stuff. Absolutely out of nowhere, she makes direct eye contact with me and just goes like, do you think this is funny? So in like fourth grade, I developed this habit like when I'm annoyed to like bite like the inside part of like my cheek like the fle like the really fleshy part to me it just felt like i was frowning so i thought i was frowning but like i guess what it really looked like a really like smug smile like the i don't care smile like it was a side smile and i guess that really got on her nerves now, i'm not really good at explaining things under pressure so i was just like so i said something along the lines of Oh yeah, I just thought of a funny moment. She instantly replied with, Oh, now you're just giving me attitude. Now you gotta call your parents and tell them exactly what you did. So I ended up having to call my parents and explaining to them what happened. But like everyone else, you know those slips that like say, Oh, you're in trouble and you gotta get them signed by their parents? Yeah, all the other guys, they, they gotta get one of those. Well, I had to like explain how there was a full-on brawl at my school. Well, anyways, guys, that's the end of my story. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, why not hit that like button? If you want to see more content just like this, or if you're just new to the channel, why not subscribe? Um, if you guys subscribe, uh, you'll get one. You'll you'll get one free chicken nugget, one McNugget from McDonald's, free of charge. Just hit that subscribe button. That's all it takes. I'm hilarious. See you in the next video. I just want you to understand